Hey everybody, CK here, and I'm coming to you guys with another video, and this happens to be my wing liner tutorial. I've been promising you guys for a long time, but I wanted to make sure that the angles were right, okay? So, of course, I had to do a voiceover because I cannot talk while I'm doing my wing. So the way I start my wing is I create the wing first, and then I connect it and then I begin to fill it in. I know a lot of people start from the middle or some start from the inner corner of the eye. Just remember in makeup, you know, learn the basics and then do what's best for you, okay? Because what works for you may not work for the next person, right? Like we we may all tie our shoes differently, just saying, okay? So this is how I do mine. Once I get the tail on there and life is great, then I go to the tip and I begin to connect everything. And once I connect everything, I go back right here and then I connect it even more and I begin to build up a little bit, all right? Now, I love, love, love a wing liner, y'all. And I've been rocking it for like many, many years, but I still mess up. So in case you mess up, all you have to do is use a Q-tip like this. It's one of those mini rounded Q-tips. So I will make sure that I have a link in the description box for you. And I also wanna like make a note or point this out to you guys that even though I've been rocking a wing for years, I still like to use my hand as a guide okay i'm not one of those girls that can do a wing and just do it with one hand and not even have to touch my face or not have to pull my eye back so if you still have to do that you guys go ahead and do that and just know i'm being gentle too but go ahead and do that all right you ain't got a lot to kick it no i'm just kidding but feel free to do whatever it is you need to do or whatever makes you feel comfortable okay so since i'm already up in your grill i figured i would take this opportunity to show you guys how i apply my falsies as well so first i set my lashes with the mascara because it brings all the lashes together and it allows me to place the lash band easier so I use an eyelash applicator which I will have in the description box as well you guys I think I got it for like a buck okay and then I proceed with my fingers because that is how I learned to put on my lashes and I don't know I'm just most comfortable doing that but applying it with my fingers it doesn't get it directly on my lash line so that's why I use the applicator okay and you guys may want to put a little more glue at the tips or at the ends of the lashes because those are the parts that lift easily or that lift up first so that's why I'm making sure that those are on there really really good and then I'm gonna turn to the side real quick because that's when I can tell if it's lifting up a little already and this is another trick after you put your lashes on sometimes it disturbs the liner so I just put a little more on and this tip right here you guys know I love to put a little liner in the corner right there because it gives it more depth and it makes the wing liner pop as well here's another tip if you get glue on your lash and it's showing, put a little black eyeshadow on there, girl. And that is it for this look, you guys. I love you so much. You guys have an awesome, blessed day. Make sure you check out this video and I will see you in the next video. Bye and I love ya.